I just had an idea for a great tool for you, and it's about the soap canister. So I have a soap canister in my office and in all the other bathrooms, and my husband likes to keep them filled. So I went in there this morning, and there was no soap in there. And I found myself feeling angry with my husband, as though it was his job. And I laughed. So I thought, this is what we'll talk about. Is it a man's job, who's in your relationship, to fill your soap canister? Just because he likes to do that. So go ahead and imagine it's your husband's or your boyfriend or a guy who's dating a job to feed you or to fill up your soap canister. And you pay him in your mind for doing that by uh, giving him sex and love and affection and your time. And then the soap canister is not filled. Do you feel angry with him for not doing his job? Sure, of course you do. Absolutely. And what if it's not his job? What if he just likes to do it, but it's still empty and you're used to him doing it? You gonna feel angry? Yeah, you're still gonna feel angry because you are giving him, you are paying him in your mind, in your time and your affection and your physicality, right? Well, that's just one piece of what this could look like. So what's the other piece is, suppose he's not giving you the affection and attention that you want, and you're starting to feel lonely around him. You're starting to feel like you have to reach to get what you need, that you have to start things, that you have to initiate, that you have to tell him nice things, that you have to ignore all of that stuff because you feel like it's your fault, like it's something you're doing. So let's look at these two options. Angry and either stuff it down or yell at him, however you express yourself in that moment, or you just think it's something wrong with you and so you don't say anything and you keep trying harder and harder and harder. These two poles are what most of us women do. We think it's his job to do some things, but making us feel happy in the moment, we don't think of as his job. We think of it as our job, like there's something wrong with us, but we're also angry and lonely because it's not happening. So how about if you just looked at all of this as his like, his not like, having very little to do with you, and all you need to do is find the words to speak to him, like, Honey, I felt so silly this morning. I went and I noticed the, the soap thing was empty, and I kept thinking of it as your job. And I, I could do it myself, but it's like, how weird. What do you think? Do you want to fill up my soap container for me, or should I just go do it myself? That's one way to speak to him. And also, you know what? I just really noticed a feeling really kind of lonely and disconnected. Is there something I should know? Is there something going on? Is it something I'm doing? Because that's what I'm feeling like, and I don't like feeling that way. Or something going on with you? Or is there something wrong? Or is it just a matter of time we can schedule? Because I really like to be with you. <laughs>